Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This my name is Afro Luigi, and this is my X Rebirth Let's Play. Um, we're we're, we're exact, pretty, almost exactly where we left off. I've let some time pass, and we are about to um, transfer our 100 energy cells over for the freighter. That no, this would should be more impressive, but since we have such a small cargo capacity, we're only having one ship. But if there was like massive amounts of cargo back, there'd be f ships going back and forth between these stations. And there, dropped off. The ship should be returning to the the uh, fr freighter. There it goes, right there. Let me contact the station and see if you can get a meeting for the weapons. All right, bring her into dock. Okay, uh, where am I docking? There we go, you should. At the bar, once again. In the future, all business meetings happen in bars. Conference rooms. Who Field needs them? Report on the way. Um, yeah, that was the freighter. Just said, "Yep, we're done." This is the Albion Skunk requesting permission to dock. Can't we already have permission? Ooh, cutscene. So yeah, Plutarch is obviously gonna end we're obviously gonna end up fighting Plutarch at some point. What is that? What is that? Oh that's just a strut or something. I was hoping that would be a ship. Bar. Subtle. I guess this is supposed to be like wet floor sign or just caution that there's work going on. Uh dance club is where we're going, I think, or is there a sign saying bar this way? Yeah, dance club bar. Uh, is that below us or same level? Nah, we're about to find out. Guess I'm not supposed to go that way. Hey, look, XP on the frontier uh, arcade games. Oh, okay, we're supposed to be going this way. Okay, we're not going that way. This way. Um, the Xenon are, um, the Xenon, which you just mentioned, are a machine race, uh, formerly known as the Terraformers. They were built by Earth in its early ages of, built by the Terrans from Earth in the early age of days of space exploration. They were meant to, um, as their na original name says, terraform, uh, planets to make them habitable for humans. Um, naturally something went wrong with the setting out machines to do it. Um, they were AGI, so they had gold drift. Eve Eventually, humans said, oh, we have enough colonies, and they sent the shutdown order. A few years later, a fleet of terraformers showed up and started destroying everyone. Um, that would have been the end of Earth if it wasn't for a few, uh, the last rem remnants of the Terran fleet sacrificing themselves to fly through the jump gate, which we'll learn about later, to and blow it up behind them, luring the Xenon, the terraformer fleet through. The, that, that fleet became known as the Argon, actually colonized the planet and eventually started calling themselves the Argon. Um, but, and forgot all about Earth. Um, we are Argon, and Albion, where we are now, is an Argon system. Um, the only time Earth showed up in the game series is in the very first opening scene of X Beyond the Frontier. At the very end of X Reunion, a Terran fleet shows up. And then Terran Conflict, of course, has Earth and Albion Prelude as well. But the Xenon are the descendants of the Terraformers and have mutated, well, evolved slash mutated to be very powerful, very deadly machines. And let's continue on with the Hello, mission. Hello, Captain. I'm Lieutenant Gimbel. 
Thanks for the delivery. We sure needed some supplies. When Plutarch is sniffing around, it's never business as usual. Happy to help. A mutual friend said you needed help. No need to be coy, Captain. We're free to talk here. I know you have Lieutenant Taryn on board. Trust her to get all the fun assignments. Dig up dirt on Plutarch here. Lay low with this unassuming young captain and his unique ship. <laughs> you know I can hear you, right? I know, just having a bit of fun. So, you want weapons? Yisha said you may have some old plasma weapons laying around. Sure we do. Plutarch doesn't like the idea of ex-military force running around like we own the place. We're limited to half the firepower Plutarch has. It helps them sleep at night. Don't expect me to use them on either of you. Right, you're neutral. That must be fun. <laughs> weapons are yours. Pontifex knows our engineers need something to do. Hope you enjoy the new guns. Um, Pontifex is a parented title, interestingly enough. Um, I think Pontifex is either the high priest or the god? No, it's the high priest slash president slash prime minister of the Paranid. I think that's what a Pontifex is. Don't quote me on that, though. All I know is it's a very high-ranking Paranid title. And apparently it's been used by the Argon now. Oh, I, w I hope the Paranids show up there. They have pretty cool-looking ships, and they were actually a very cool, interesting race. Aside from the fact that they were very arrogant. What am I supposed to do in getting back to the ship, I assume? Uh, can I just... Is there a way to check, check objectives or something? No. Well, let's go back to the ship. Give these babies a try. We should look for some asteroids. More it's asteroids. A really versatile ship. I keep an eye out for more weapons for sale from mechanics. Okay, switched. I've switched to my plasma cannons. Ooh, Sunstalker missiles. Speed crush to the dump fire. Captain Otani, Lieutenant Taran. Please, Captain. No need to be so formal. I'm hardly military. Technically neither am I, but old habits die hard. We've just been cleared by the Plutarch Intelligence Agency. You should be clear to come back soon. Aw, and we were just about to have fun with guns. <laughs> back to the rendezvous location. We'll meet you there. Borman out. Okay. Well, Otani, it's been fun. I'd invite you to stay, but I fear Plutarch would put us on their most wanted list. Sorry, Otani. That is After a nice you've known me for a few hours, the odds are you're already on their most wanted list. Good to know. Okay. Waypoints. Yeah, that was really funny. Fly to the big empty. Uh oh. Um, I think I hit another bug, guys. Hold on. Joke. Well, that turned out not to be a problem with this game, but actually with DX Story. DX Story crashed on me, so I was able to fix that up, and we're back to it. Um, let's get to the rendezvous. I could really get the back speed boost, I think. No. Ran out of time. Big empty. It's worth a shot. Admitting rendezvous point now. Okay. Well, let's enter the superhighway. There we go. Yeah. 
and this is going to be a long flight. Just if I can't behind get behind someone faster with a smaller ass. Oh, we made it. Off to Sandy Vault next. Entering the third Duke. Transmitting rendezvous point. I guess before I go, I can impart some of my vast knowledge to you. Uh -oh. Have you used the long range scan mode? That mode can help you find small objects at a distance. I've heard that this sector has quite a lot of wreckage and crates drifting out there. So, is that are we supposed to go scanning or not? Apparently, we're just apparently not. Eh, turn. There we go. In we go. Exit in 500 kilometers. Five hundred, three hundred. Whoop! No, want to stay up here. Over. There we go. Whoa, we're going fast. Uh, 40, 30, 20, 10, now. Entering Shady Vault. Transmitting rendezvous point now. Okay, apparently we're not supposed to be scanning for loot in this system. It's not this time. I think I'll do that in another episode. I think I want. Whoa. Okay, that's supposed to happen. Uh, that's not a ship coming up behind me. That's disappointing. This is going to be a long one, I think. Oh, wait. No. Down. There we go. I wonder what determines how what these ship, how fast these ships can go. Is that like priority access, or maybe they're just using their boost engines? What did I just bump into? Crossroads. No idea. Oh well. On to crossroads. Point Ren, I'm not liking how some of these Plutarch ships are behaving. So you stopped us on the they highways right there. Us. They're watching us. Maybe we should speed it up a bit. I don't really want to start a chase. Oh, we're in the highway now. We're in a chase. Uh, down. Nope. Fly to Watergate. Here we go. But yeah, we're being followed. Whoa. Uh-oh. There we go. We actually make it through that, but I don't think that was supposed to happen. But yeah, this game just came out, and there's bound to be bugs, so Egosoft is working as fast as they can to patch whatever that was that just happened. So. Whoa, that guy's a big ass. Let's bump up one. All these ships with fat asses. There we go. Much better. Okay, auspicious excavation. Transmitting rendezvous point now. Four hundred kilometers. Three hundred. Whoa. Two hundred kilometers. One hundred sixty. One hundred forty. One hundred ninety. Eighty seventy sixty fifty forty thirty twenty ten. Now there we go. Entering auspicious excavation. There's our destination. I think way over there. Transmitting new coordinates to following ship. Okay, let's no sign of Borman yet. <laughs> what is going on here? That's quite a crowd gathering. There's some Plutarch ships approaching. Is is the jump gate open? I'm taking uh -oh. us closer. 
Um, jump gates are ancient devices built by an uh, unknown species called the Ancients in the War. Borman? We've lost the signal. I don't like this. I'll be in the skunk. Stop your engines and prepare to be escorted. No. Sorry, Ren. We've got to ditch them. You should don't. Uh oh. Entering system. Wow, that'll take some getting used to. What the hell did you do that for? It was either that or get arrested. At least out here we can gain some distance. I see highways. This is what I signed on for. Why shouldn't I just turn around? They'll probably shoot anything emerging from the gate before asking questions. And they're probably after you too now. I'll put some distance between us and the gate. We'll try and talk our way out of this. Until then, try and figure out where we are. This system isn't in the database. I'm seeing highways and debris, but no activity. Our gate shouldn't lead here. Right. It should have connected to the Belt of Aguilar system. This isn't it. Let's hope the highways point to a friendly civilization. Um, but yeah, the gates were built by an ancient civilization, and they had been known to shut down, turn on if shut down. The only race known to have built jump gates is Terrans, and they've only built three in history. The first one, which is what connected them to original gate network, which is where we are now. And then one they sent to Proxima Centauri, but I'm not sure if they ever recorded it actually making it, though. And then they built a third one in one of the games. Um, but yeah, the first gate they built connected to the network, and they started sending ships there, and then the terraformers went through it. The first gate was destroyed when the fleet I mentioned in an earlier episode lured the ter terraformers through and destroyed it behind them. And now, uh, Belt of Arcular was an Argon system in the previous games, but this is apparently a new one. And what the gates have been known to read. The gate network shut down in the game year lore about 20 or 30 years ago or something, and. Um, this is Plutarch Security. The jump gate is in lockdown until full quarantine procedures can be initiated. Any ships attempting unauthorized transit will be destroyed without further warning. This is Ren Otani, captain of the Albion Skunk. Can't you just let us through? We just got here. They're not responding. Hopefully, they'll be focusing on the gate so much, they'll forget all about us. Not to mention, it gives us the chance to be the first to explore this system. You make it sound like a good thing. Um, but the gates have been known to have been known to reconnect to the gate network has been known to redesign itself. Uh-oh, we're being attacked. I'm out of here. This place doesn't look like it's been this gate doesn't look like it's been used in a while. What is that over there? Look, see that long thin station? And out in the gate network somewhere is the Xenon, so that's probably what Plutarch's worried about, that this is a Xenon sector. Former formerly known as the Terraform- the race formerly known as the Terraformers, built by the Terrans. There's a super gate over there- oh, super highway over there, another super highway. Shouldn't the ship still be saying unknown sector because, well, whoa, almost hit the rock. Shouldn't this ship's computer be saying unknown sector because I haven't explored here before? But yeah, it looks like uh, we're supposed to be heading towards that structure. Like this will take us deeper into the system. Maybe there are people closer to the sun. Yes, um, closer to the sun. Exactly where we go. We're already pretty close. Hey, look, there's ships down there. Let's piggyback. No comments about the ship, Yisha? That's kind of disappointing. I actually looked over to my right to see if I could talk to her, but she's not there. I'm picking up ships nearby, heading this way. I don't know who they are. Get on the comm. They don't look too friendly. Just get on the comm. Look Tell this. them we're not from around oh! here. Oh! This is the Albion Skunk. Identify yourself. This is an old art. This is an old mine. Um, station. Um, 
I recognize this actually looks like an old station, an old mine. What is happening there? There was a mining operation here at some point. Oh, that I must have been scanned. It was abandoned. But yeah, um, that's that's what an old mine used to look like. You used to have that little structure, cylindrical structure there, made of scaffolding and stuff. That's cool. That they flat, that they nodded back to the previous games in the series. But, uh. Well, this is the main episode, guys. I'm going to leave it here. I'll bring it back in when we're through this highway.